What's up guys, Chasing Lamy here with episode number 13 of The Journey. And in today's episode we have a big league clash against Haranossans. And we've got some stuff to catch you up on the last three games that you missed. And hopefully, hopefully we'll see a victory. So, I'm going to see you on the other side of the credits. Back in a sec. <laughs> So here we go guys, uh, today the game at home against Harnessons, here's what you've been missing, it's been a weird few games, the last game we saw of course was the TGFF game, uh, we then beat Itur Hogdals who were top of the table 2-0, I thought oh, we're back on form now, things are things are looking up, things are working, um, Lidstrom and Nicholson got themselves goals, Venabro missed an early penalty which was disappointing, but such is life, we then played Piteo who are having an interesting season. Uh, we lost 5-3. Uh, Yannick Lidstrom and Venebro getting themselves on the score sheet. Venebro having a blinder of a game, but Edstrom got himself a hat-trick. And uh, Rosengren and Hedstrom got themselves goals as well. Uh, Pateo are interesting uh, in that when we played them, uh, we were 6th and they were 12th, I believe. Um... But they seem to be picking up a little bit of a head of steam. I'm not sure why, and I don't want to ask too many questions, but they're starting to score a lot of goals. I don't know if they just started the season with injuries. I don't know what their pre-season prediction was, uh, or how to find it, apparently. They predict to finish third, so maybe they just started the season with a lot of injuries, but they've suddenly come really good. And it's starting to be a real concern. They might be in the hunt with us towards the end of the season. Uh, we then uh, played Ostersund. Uh, they beat us 2-0. Goals from Lewis Baker and Victor Agascar. Uh, Lewis Baker, by the way, uh, not really had the great. I don't know how he. I don't know how this guy ended up in Sweden. Um, I don't even know who Gene Field Swifts are, if I'm perfectly honest. But he's ended up in Sweden. Um, anyway. That is that is the the info for the day. Let's get into the game because that's what you all came to see. Let's be perfectly honest. You didn't come to hear me talk about it. You just came to see us do it. Uh, I don't think I want to make any major changes to the teams. The one there I'm noticing is glaringly obvious. It should be in there. Not really. Not straight away. Okay. Let's just play the game. Let's see what happens. I would like us to pick up a good win here today. Harnessons have not looked the best. They are, I believe, 12th in the league. They're towards the bottom end, at least. Um, so I'd like this to be a fairly easy victory for us. They're going with a standard 4-4-2. A lot of young players there. A lot of regens. That could bode nicely in our favour. Uh, let's tell the assistant to do what the assistant does. Let's check up on where they are in the league. Here, yeah, Harnessons are thirteenth, so they're just one off the bomb. Soda Harms, by the way, are done. They're done. Um, <laughs> I can't see them staying up now, and we've got to play them next week. So hopefully, a good win here will set us up for another good win uh, next week. You'd hope. <laughs> uh, we need an early goal. We might be getting an early goal. We're not getting an early goal, are we? It's not going to happen. It's just a kick-off highlight. Relax. Don't panic. All will be fine. Maybe. Alan, he's through. Come on. Maybe there is a goal at the end of this. Lidstrom. Robert Lidstrom with a goal after 37 seconds. We've started in business, boys. We've started in business. That is undeniably the way. Undeniably the way right now. So I just, my phone started making weird sounds. Um, anyway, Lidstrom there with a beautiful finish and couldn't have asked for a better start to the game at all. Just hope we can keep it up. One shot on goal, one shot on target, one goal. Not bad. Be nice for us to be able to get a couple of places in the league out of this. I don't know if we if we can. I th I'm fairly sure we can. Um, would be nice to pick up a couple of places though. Bit of hoof ball. Oh, Lanesio has taken his eye off the ball there. Luckily, Ben Salah was paying attention, but Lanesio almost left us in some severe. 
severe trouble then. Big trouble. Carlson's got himself a corner, crosses it over. Anderson just just dings it out. Nice job. <sighs> We're up into fourth. That's good. That's one position gain. Ogren with a free kick. Thought Venebro was going to get his head in it, and he doesn't. The worrying number of guys forward, and they seem to be on the break now. That's not a good sign at all. Uh, Janae, come on, someone get someone get this clear. Anyone get a foot in. Over the top. Come on, you should have been there, Ogren. Oh, it's clear. All right, I feel less. I feel less worried now. Larson's put the ball forward. I thought. I thought Yannick was going to make make the magic happen. We're still in possession. While we're in possession, things could happen. I don't like Lamine Allen being that far back. That's not ideal. He is definitely not a right back. Big ball forward. They're just going to keep coming at us and coming at us. And now they're through Frege. Oh, no. It's that long ball over the top every single time that kills us. Every single time. Oh, it doesn't even have to be a particularly good one, a particularly pretty one. Our defence just doesn't seem to understand. The long ball over the top will kill us every single time. Let's do a shout. I want to see some passion from the boys. Fired up. Good. That's what I like to see. Hanson with a free kick to Carlson. So get to him quickly. Get the ball out. Don't back off. Don't back off. shouldn't even be that hard ah tactics tactics I don't want to see that again I'm sorry if you do but you can rewind the video if you want uh, I want to drop that defensive line back a little bit I think such a small change but I just want to drop the defensive line back a little bit because those long balls over the top are killing us. Uh, we are going to close Frey down. Uh, we're also going to push forward. Allen gets the crossover. Lidstrom, I need him to do something here. Good cross in. Larson, Ogren, Allen. Oh, he's hit the post. Come on. What they to Harnessons would be an unbelievably embarrassing result for us. Like there are no words for how embarrassing that would be. Demand more. Oh, just a wayward ball, apparently. Wayward ball picked up by Hansen. They're going to come on the attack now. I'd like them to not score a third. That would be ideal. Venebro. Good ball forward. Is Yannick clean through? He is. Who's supporting him? Anyone supporting him? Penalty. Beautiful. Venebro is going to take it. I need him to not miss this. That would be ideal. Getting a lot of penalties on the channel at the moment. And we don't seem to be scoring a lot. Venebro. Oh, he's put it in. Beautiful. Two all. We're back in the game, boys. We're back in the game. That is the way forward. Nothing clever, nothing big, just a little cheeky tap towards the, the post. Snuck it away. Beautiful. Okay. Business, boys. Business. There. Let's drop some praise on them. If it'll ever let me drop some praise on them. At com. Get a cross in, son. Yannick. Back to Anderson. Anderson. Oh! Oh, so close. Okay. Starting to feel it, lads. I'm starting to feel like I can get in. I can get something out of this game. Um, we've dropped down to sixth, which is worrying. But two more points would kind of put us up into fourth. We'd have to do a thorough smashing to get into third, but fourth is still doable. So we'll see how that goes. Venebro. Oh, what was? Jesus, don't give it away like that. Okay. Things aren't looking awful. We're all over them. But 
it's not quite it's not quite the way we need it to be is it um going to push forward frustrated if you were already pushing forward you wouldn't be being yelled at and getting frustrated that seems fairly straightforward to me uh, what changes can I make what well, how do I put some life back into this game um, I kind of want to send on Hagland but I don't like I know I need to make changes I don't know what changes I need to make and that's what's really getting to me is that I'm not it's not obvious to me where the change is I think maybe we just do a bunch of subs for fitness and hope that is what what it takes uh, we'll put Bergam on we will put Yahya on we will put Hagland on Nick Lassen on Uh, maybe a cheeky wee guest appearance from Isaacson. Let's sort back to the other formation because I just have a little bit more faith in it at the moment. Little changes. Five subs at the same time though. That's bold. Bold. Now the yellow cards start. Beautiful. Yellow cards raining in everywhere. Come on guys. One last attack, that's all I ask. Nope. Nope. Well, that's disappointing, isn't it? Um, I'm glad we came back. I'm glad we came back from behind. We shouldn't have ever been behind, but I'm glad we showed some fight. We came back. I'm uh, a little bit disappointed that our midfield seemed to go missing. I s s a lot I need to think about with the defence. Like, the defence doesn't seem to really... Um, doesn't seem to really have much going for it at the moment. And that's really annoying, frankly. I, um, I've i invested a lot in the team. Sorry, I, I'm, I keep yawning. I, invest, I, I probably should it's not because I'm not enjoying it. I'm just exhausted. I've just done about... Eight months worth of coursework in four days. Um, yeah, it's just uh, I don't I don't understand why this team isn't capable of performing. Uh, is it an offensive issue? Do I have a Do I have maybe a lack of pace in defence? Is what I keep thinking. Like, should I be looking at a a quicker defender maybe? Like, I tried Karlborg and he was terrible. We tried him out because he kept moaning and he was just among the worst defenders I've ever seen in my life. So I'm not sure if he's the answer. Um, there is a lad who keeps moaning, Vyborg. Uh, I'm, I'm tempted to try Adam Personnel. Because uh, I know he's at least decent. I've got this lad, Pliatsikas. So Augustus Viking. See Augustus Viking might get he might be getting a shot, I think. He's gonna get a shot for a while. I'm gonna try him out. Anyway, that's just me thinking out loud whilst doing this. Uh that is going to be the end of the episode, guys. I'm sorry I went on that little bit of a ramble then. I don't know what really was happening. Um if you've enjoyed this video, please smash that like button, hit the subscribe button for more from the journey from Saving Swindon, from the random Steam games and from whatever else I end up playing. There is going to be a random Steam game coming out this weekend and maybe, maybe we'll finally get to Life is Strange. Um, yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. If you look in the comments below in the description, sorry, you will find a whole bunch of links to the Steam and the Facebook communities, to the cheap copy of FM19 to a whole bunch of other stuff in there um so do check out the link below uh until then guys i have been chasing lamely leave me a comment let me know you've been watching as well that's the thing i tell you leave me a comment let you know let me know you've been watching 
I've been Chasing Lamely, thank you very much for watching, I will see you next time, and until then, have a good one. see you soon.